your guy Sidok here coming at you with a brand new BF4 video and basically I'm just gonna have a brief rundown because I got to play a little bit the new game mode zombie rushed which is like I'm just play basically it's a run that it's like normal like not classical zombies basically you just have to fight zombies get points and play competitive so whoever gets the most points the most bonus feeds etc you know times to XX number of whatever times it is, multiplier as you will. But before we go into that, two things. One, the fact that I've got Ghost Sea Dog on this overall overlay and slash layout. Basically, this is the last video you will see with that because if you're not aware to the team, we've gone back to EXR sniping instead of having Ghost Clan, so we have gone back to old roots. So I will be changing my game attack at some point, <coughs> but for this thing, this overlay you're looking at, the last time you'll see it is in this video, guys. And well, you know, and the other thing, basically, there's a bunch of fucking crap. I got shit in there. Bear with me, always, because there's big boxes. I got more shit in there. You guys are sat here like, what the fuck is he ordering? And last but not least, that fucking money. So guys, if you're wondering what all this is, basically, I am doing a full rundown of my setup, make a full remake of it. I'll be streaming the rebuild of it. I'll be doing an aftermath of it, you know, a finished piece, like a sort of left to right of the new setup look. Maybe just the transitionable music as like an intro. Then you know, do like sort of do my normal one before, just have an introduction. Sat on my ass, just have a little rundown of what's what, you know, what the changes are. Um, yeah, that's all I'm really, uh, guys. But without further ado, let's go straight into this lovely ass rushed game mode. Alright, the first thing I want you to notice guys is just the fact that it's out of zero points. You can on my um what you call gobble gums, I forgot what you call them in this game. In this BFR. Oh, yeah. the other thing to note out is I the box is like in every link single location. And also the like, the zombies just run at you. Uh, and all the windows are open, so I have like a few things to bear out and bear in mind. Oops. So obviously as you can see I've got 1600 and times 5. That is basically just the reference of the multiplayer, like say if you keep going and keep doing what you want. These things are also like they add to your multiplier, just run out. But basically as you keep going, like your multiplier goes up so do your points. And there ain't much to it other than just competitiveness and a set of uh, leaderboard and a challenge, like what you can all go for. And obviously there's a number of things like save you stay out of the way too long, like say you don't go to the right area after a certain amount of time. You basically um how you'd say I like, lose multiplier like, every second. Um so that's just like something to bear in mind and also like for me this is just a like, I'd class this as an achievement on any sort of thing because there's achievements for it, like I a few off the top of my head uh, Get 500 like, score total um, in a sort of co op base where you and your teammates have to, like, you gotta get 500 between you and your mates, and the other one is 250,000, which is half of that, but on your own. And then there's the other one of you gotta get a times 100 multiplier. Like, the 250 and the 100 multiplier are like my two main at the moment, like, for Chaos Mode. Um, which is, you know, basically zombies rushed. Which, I don't seem to be getting very fast. I get so close to doing it, especially with classified and... Nah, bloop, and I'm like... Right. 
Like my goal, like right there, day true. What I'm after, boy. Oh, shit. Multiplier building. Good. Nice. Um, as you can see, if I could do like the hundred early, it helps because the more multiplier you have, the faster your points go. See going to the parents and dropping down and stuff and really good points. Good. Double points because even on top that is also a great sign. Extra life. Do -do -do. So if you saw just then guys like my multiplayer drop. That's why I got dead shot because it helps the points as well as you know getting my multiplayer like it seems to be fast with headshots so dead shot is like a, like just to me a must. Special weapon ready. Right yeah guys it is kinda of obvious I'm doing a live commentary just this is just a free walk because if I do shit I do shit. But I'm basically just giving you a guy like say you in the room I am now. You're sort of limited to this particular room for a certain amount of time. And then you get like Multipliers at the end, you gotta run, fucking grab them all the best you can, and then that adds to your multiplier event of you. You gotta just keep hold of it as best as possible, which is the overall aim for this, is just to survive all the way around the map, and keep your multiplier as best as possible, and you know, get as many points as possible, and just play to win. The thing I want to just note is just the simple fact that your multiplayer goes down if you get hit. So like, there's a number of things you lose, you can lose your multiplayer on that is really, and you got to be cautious. I got like a 35 or 47k um, bonus as you will. So like normally you got like every time you go to a new location you get said um, multipliers. So it's just something to keep an eye as you will. I didn't even know it was a thing, I didn't know you had to stay in that certain area. And I've just gone down to six. She's really good, man. Right, I'm doing well for myself. Right, right now I'm on 56. Like, I do iffy between like the 250. Alright, achievement where you have to get 250 points yourself or get 100 times multiplier. Alright, it's a skeptical scenario. I don't know which one I'm going to do first because my, my game actually pans out. Depending on which one I do first. I right, obviously using your specialist weapons really will grind. Um, yeah, points and multiplier along with. I'm going to add that. I'm going to walk them at it. Oh, this is where I was going wrong, because I went the wrong bit too early. Guys, this is actually the bit where I like to grind if I can keep my multiplayer to where it is, but I tend to lose it around now, so it's kind of an awkward conundrum, so to speak. So, the second, I'm running to here, 
this multiplayer is going down because it's been a while since I've actually had the multiplayer with them particular kills. It's a bit of a how you say it, for them. Multiplier building. My ass in here. Now, this is probably my favourite bit, just for the simplisticness. Uh, you know, I can sit in this one little corner and just relax. Just the simplisticness of double points, multiplier. I can really go for some grinder, which I do need my specialist weapon at this point. It would be nice. And there's an insta kill right there, and I can't grab it. What can I? Insta kill! The more insta kills, the merrier. It just makes my life easier because this is like my favourite area just to do these. Multipliers in just because of how extra life. You know, large the area is and you're just stuck in one corner really focusing. Obviously, I'm kind of going to lose this again. Do that for the simplicity. As that was going down, I just gained 61 because then you just butchered the zombies for me. I've also got a good 53, like to my name right now. But I could potentially grind up for this 100. If I get lucky in a sense, like I'm trying not to die. As all because I'm going to start losing it, I don't want to lose it, it's been doing really good. I, my highest is 91, so I know I can do it. Ah, uh, fuck it. Just as I say that. Down. I keep going down, I'm not even going to get these points. I'm not even going to be able to do what I want to do because I got 22, I got 96. Stop dying because I'm gonna die and lose this game. I got 180 out of 250, so it's kind of like kind of under my alert because normally I'm not doing this bad. And my goal is just to go for the 250 because it's easier to do and easier to really grind towards. So I just say that briefly, reload and get all these. Multiplier right. Uh, so that right here. Door open. You see, by the time I've done the Griffin station bit, I'm usually about 220. So it's like easy ass to do. Oh, what do you do? I think they change everything. This is a fucking dog.
Right, because I'm not watching, I'm not really using audio. I'm getting hit, so I'm losing me multiplier. So I'm just playing it on the cautious side because I seem to be more focused on the points. I think I've got a times nine multiplier. It's not special, but I mean, so I'm actually myself to eighty right, in this video, which is nice. But right, the goal is 100 and the most I can push myself to. When I'm in that, like before going to move a bit just before it, that's me to 91 really easy. die when I get close to something but guys I hope you enjoyed this little 15 minute video 60 minute video don't forget to smash the like button if you're new be sure to smash the like button if you enjoyed the video subscribe